Elephants can read too, by Andrea Kazmarek. Ollie and his little sister Izzy love to play all day. Ollie and Izzy play so many games, but at bedtime they love to snuggle up with their cuddly toys. They have lots of bedtime friends: Poppy Cat, Penny Dog, Drago Dragon, Cuddles Koala, Henry Penguin, Barney Owl. And bright green dino dinosaur, but Stripey the bright elephant is the best. Every night they snuggle up with all those toys for a good night story. Ollie and Izzy and the toys love their mum's bedtime story. That's when trouble starts. Ollie and Izzy run, jump, skip, and play all day long. So when they go to bed, they are so very, very tired. Sometimes they are so sleepy they can hardly keep their eyes open, and never ever hear the end of their goodnight story. Their mum always laughs and closes the storybook. Sweet dreams. She switches off the light. So the bedtime toys never ever get to hear the end of the story. Henry Penguin frowns. Did that little owl find his red balloon or not? We'll never know. Penny Dog shakes his head. Pity none of us can read. We could find out. Stripey Elephant wiggles his big, colourful ears. The toys all stare at Stripey Elephant. Poppy Cat, Penny Dog, Henry Penguin, Cuddle Koala, Barney Owl, and Green Dino all have that look. Read! The toys shout out loud. One of us has to learn to read. Then we can read our own stories. Stripey Elephant doesn't like the way they all look at him. Elephants are smart and never forget anything. Henry Penguin laughs. So an elephant can learn to read. Penny Dog nods. Tonight's story is about a gorilla who escapes from the zoo but can't find his way back. Ollie and Izzy fall asleep just before the end. The toys all shake their heads. We'll never know, will we? Mum switches off the light. Ollie and Izzy are already dreaming of gorillas. Stripey Elephant snuggles deep and whispers into Ollie's ear, "We never hear the end of the story. Please teach me to read." Stripey Elephant rolls over to Izzy and whispers exactly the same. The next day, Ollie and Izzy laugh about their very silly dream. Stripey Elephant wants to learn to read. Ollie and Izzy look for their school word cards. Easy words. Izzy smiles. Easy words for Stripey Elephant: big, dog, house, mouse, cat, hat, red, and play. They laugh. Now, Stripey, let's try to read these. First word, Stripey. Izzy holds up the picture of a big dog. Big dog. I don't like big dogs. Stripey falls off the bed. Ollie picks him up. There's a mouse in the house. He shows him the card with a house and a mouse. I don't like a mouse in the house. Stripey falls off again. All the toys are quietly waiting under the bed and listening. Can you read, Stripey? Henry Penguin asks. There's a big dog in a house with a mouse. Stripey smiles. Wow, Penny Dog grins. That's a good story. That night's bedtime story is about a rabbit looking for lost carrots. They all fall asleep. Stripey has his reading lessons every day. Stripey can now read so many words: cat, hat, mouse, house, cow, frog, fish, and bus. But even though these are good words for a cuddly, coloured elephant, there was never ever a bedtime story with a mouse in a bus with a fish and a frog. Then Stripey has the best idea. He snuggles up to Izzy and whispers, "Thank you for teaching me to read. I like reading, but what we really want is to hear the end of the story. 
your mum never reads the end of the story. Can you ask her to finish the story, please? For us toys? Stripey rolls over to Ollie and whispers the same. And that's what happened. Mum thinks it's a very, very silly idea to finish the story for the toys. But she does it, even though she reads a bit faster. Well, a lot faster. I don't think she really does her best reading. She gets faster and I think she leaves bits out. Henry Penguin shakes his head. But we do hear the end of the story. Penny Dog thinks the others are being mean. How is your reading, Stripey? Brilliant, Stripey smiles. I can read cat, hat, mouse, house, frog, fish, moon, and yesterday I learned dragon, dino, and even koala. And what about me, owl? Can't you even read me yet? Everyone knows owl is the best word ever. Stripey smiles and wriggles his bright coloured ears. Elephant is the best and biggest word. Everybody knows that. So, elephants can read. And all toys love a bedtime story. The end. Thank you for reading with storyberries.com. Free stories for kids. <laughs>